Hey everyone, this is uh, Rodney Mills once again with another My Perspective video. Uh, the lesson I want to talk about today is uh, proximity distorting reality. And what I mean by that is uh, there's a lot of times where, you know, we assume a lot of things. And uh, when we assume from a distance, um, we really don't get an accurate picture of what's really going on. And so this uh, lesson uh, came to my mind when I was actually uh, deployed. Uh, I was actually on a C-130 flying into Bosnia. And um, it was a quiet flight, but uh, as we got closer to our destination, I noticed that the, uh, the attention factor and just the stress levels uh, were elevating. And um, I looked outside and I just saw bombed out buildings. We were actually flying into a war zone. And so everyone was tense and um, it was just really um, uh, very interesting to me um, because prior to that, when we first took off, um, as we're flying into the area, um, it just looked so peaceful, um, you know, from a distance. Uh, it wasn't until we got really close that you saw the devastation and uh, the bombed out buildings. And so that's one illustration. And so you probably weren't in a war zone, but um, I think we've all, most of it has been on a, an airplane flight. And um, it's probably even more prevalent at night. Um, if you've ever looked out a window while on an airplane looking down at the ground, you see the many houses with the, uh, the, the lights on. And um, from that perspective, um, it looks so peaceful. Uh, you just see a bunch of lights. Um, but the reality is, uh, we don't know whether or not that home is uh, a happy home. It's a home of uh, uh, love or a home of uh, stress, uh, of heartache, um, because the perspectives are just different. Uh, it's not until we actually get close to each one of those homes that we really know what's going on. And so um, I want you to think about that when it comes to your own life. Um, are there times where you're actually uh, forming an opinion when um, you're not really getting close to that situation or that individual. Um, I think if you draw closer, I think you are better suited to get more, better information and you could actually help that situation or that individual. Um, actually, uh, a real life uh, story um, that happened to me was that my uh, second duty assignment, I was actually a flight commander and uh, I was in charge of uh, over 100 uh, personnel and uh, one of the tech sergeants uh, came into my office one day and he just began to chew me out. Um, and if you're familiar with the military structure, uh, typically an enlisted person uh, shouldn't be chewing out an officer. Although there's, uh, I would admit there's probably times that I deserved it. <laughs> but, the, uh, but this time he was uh, just, he was uh, mad about something that was really not that significant. And I, before I started to lay into him, I just heard this voice say, ask him about his family. And so I let him finish his piece and then um, I asked him, hey, Tech Sergeant so-and-so, how's your family doing? And he just looked at me and he was like kind of stunned and he just sat down in the chair and he just slouched and he goes, and he just poured out what was going on in his life. And so after he was done, I told him, you know, I said, you know what, Tech Sergeant so-and-so, go home, take care of your family. I'll let Senior Master Sergeant so-and-so know that you're going to go home and, um, you know, we'll see you back at work tomorrow. Uh, he stood up and he just uh, thanked me and he was like, oh, thanks for you know letting me uh, spend time with my family. Really appreciate it. And so this is a really good illustration where, you know, sometimes we just got to get close to a situation. You know, I could have easily um, went off on him because uh, he was chewing me out. But uh, the reality was he was actually struggling with something and I could help. And I was able to help because I was able to get closer to him. So just remember, proximity distorts reality. And so if you're in a situation, uh, once again, that you're forming an opinion, make sure that you're getting all the facts, that you're getting close to that situation or person so you can truly help them out. Once again, this is Rodney Mills, and this is My Perspectives. Thanks for listening.